Hola amigos, Ghost here and today we're continuing our Let's Play of the Ezio Trilogy and we're continuing off straight from last time in which it's time to do the last two of uh, Leonardo's machine missions. First, one of the three war plan missions or the final war plan mission. Kill the Overseer to find the location of Leonardo's war machine and use a smoke bomb to stun the Overseer. Alright. Shouldn't be too hard to do. Oh shit. Uh, Wait, what? Okay, there we go. <laughs> it, it, for a second I thought it glitched. Uh that's funny. That's that's actually funny. Just gonna loot him just for some extra loot. And let's get to this mission. Now if I remember this one has actually three treasure in it and they're all in a, a very specific part of the mission which is more of the open open side of it too bomber Val Valnirina, something like that. Flying Machine 2.0. Leonardo has redes redesigned his flying machine with a light cannon, creating a deadly aerial weapon. Ensure that the Borgia never get to use it. Full synchronization. Do not get shot while using the bomber. That part of the mission is also pretty hard to do. Uh. Okay, the architect. I think he's in a very specific part of the this little green section. There he is. Hey, buddy. Tell me where the fucking plants are. Plans. No, I will not. Stop! Stop! Where are the plants? Past the guards. In my house. It is the last one. And the machine. In the tower. On top of the fortress. That's. Thank you. 
And burn the plans. Bam. Don't fuck this up for me. Fuck, I fucked that up. I swear, only I can fuck that up. Uh, let's see, there we go. Alright, let's actually get in this damn thing now. Uh... So the first chest is right there as you can see, there's a guard on the opposite side. The second chest I believe is in that tower, or part of the wall right over there. The third chest I think is inside the tower itself, but I'm not 100% sure. Either way, we gotta be careful. Go, I dealt with him. And we grab the chest. Bam. Now the only way to get back over to that side is that way. So let's go. I think it's in this one. Yep. There it is. Bam. Alright. Now let's climb up here. Nope, nope, nope. Ezio, what you're doing? up there but there's I think that's where the other chest is I think I saw the glowing pop pop let him get over there and then I'll kill him too pop jump I'm gonna loot both of them for their materials Bam. And bam. And I'm also gonna loot the guy up here too, since I killed him. But yeah, I think that that's this is the third chest. This is definitely the third chest. Bam. And bam. Oi. Oof. Barely made it. There we go. Also gonna loot this guy for uh, some crossbow bolts as well. Bam, we made it inside the tower. I think there's like one or two guards inside this tower too. 
So I have to be careful of those. Of them, I mean. Several even exploded, but we know this one works. <laughs> Too bad you won't be able to see it uh, work. Pop. <laughs> uh, I love that. All right, let's see if we don't fuck this up. Hello, old friend. They intend to craft more weapons. Leonardo, you will help me stop them. Oh god, here we go. Fuck! Damn it! All right, time to crash. <laughs> Fuck! I hope that resets the synchronization because I don't want to have to restart the whole memory. Fuck! That's why I try to avoid those fucking archer towers, but I kind of needed the uh, elevation. All right. Fuck! I have to restart. I'll be back. Alright, I'm back at where we were. Gotta say though, this is probably one of the, the only flaws, I guess, of Brotherhood and maybe Revelations. I, if uh, if Revelations has the same problem, I don't remember at the moment. But uh, where you there's no checkpoint system in terms of like the synchron full synchronization. So I had to restart the entire memory to get back to this point. Just be for this full synchronization thing. I feel like if there's a checkpoint, you should be able to reload from the checkpoint of the memory, so that you don't have to really restart a whole memory. Because some, if it's a, I can understand for like smaller memories that's not really needed, but for bigger memories or ones that take a little bit longer in terms of like how to get to your destination, I think there should have been like a checkpoint system that you could restart to that point and it resets the full synchronization back. So if you failed it, you can redo it while still in the same mission. But yeah, well, so hopefully we can uh, get it this time. If not, I will. I'll take the hit for a minute, and then I'll, off screen I'll get the hundred percent um, synchronization. But I'm hoping we can get it. Hopefully we can get it this time around. I'm just gonna try to avoid fucking uh, the fucking uh, towers as best as I can. Because they're basically what uh, will hit you in the end. Fuck that, I will go to the next area. Basically, this is my plan to loop between the three to avoid getting hit by the fucking archers and also staying away from the towers as best as I can 
Oh god, oh god, I think I'm not gonna make it actually. Come on. Okay, thank god. They gave me enough fucking air, but it's probably not gonna be enough, to be honest. There we go. All right. All right. So I think what I have to do is basically do that. Hopefully that hits it. Yep. Basically the only way to deal with the archers is to fucking hit them from long range while you're uh, away. Whew. Fuck! Damn it. Luckily I haven't had a checkpoint. I was too low on the air. I didn't have enough, uh... I didn't have any fire to really bring me up any further. Luckily I haven't been hit by an arrow. We're doing okay. We're doing okay. Oh god, why would you spawn me next to a fucking arrow ar uh, archer thing? Trying to sabotage me, aren't you? able to hit it. Give me some air, please. Oh, I missed. Got it. I'm gonna crash. I'm gonna crash. I don't... Oh! Oh, I forgot you could do that. I forgot. Okay, okay. That's good. Oh shit. I'm too far. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Go down. Okay. Turn. Okay. Fuck you civilians. You were literally in the way. I'm gonna screw up. Oh, no, 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 no. Come on, come on. Turn. He's gonna get away. Nope. Let's go. Oh, fucking hell. We did it. Oh. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus, man. Goodbye, old friend. <laughs> and 100% synchronized, and I got the three chests, and oof, man. That, that was tough. That was, that was tough. Oof. 
Like, seriously. <laughs> but yeah, my, uh, I won't say criticism, more like, uh, I think a flaw that they could have approved upon was, um, that, where... Ezio, news has spread that all my inventions have been destroyed. The disarray allowed me to work on something just for you. What is this? A new device to drift slowly from any height. It is not as cumbersome as my flying machine. You can take it everywhere. Grazie, Leonardo. And bam, we got the parachute now, which we can now use that to uh, go to the top, to one of the highest points in the city to uh, do that one uh, guild mission. Uh, to, uh, the parachute is actually pretty useful, even though I don't, re I don't really use it often. And but it's, it's none nonetheless, it is still very useful to uh, to use in certain circumstances. But yeah, we did it. We did all the machines. We got all those down, 100% synchronized. And now we're going to move on to the assassination contracts. But first, I'm going to withdraw my money from there. And also go over here to repair some shit. Because uh, I've taken a bunch of damage. Armor-wise, we can't get anything because these are all shop quest items. Uh, if we look at the shop quests, we are still needing one more prayer bead and shrunken heads for those. Um, the, the ammunition, we can get, we can buy ammunition, we kind of need, uh, it co crossbows, uh, crossbow bolts cost a shit ton, actually. It's, uh, it's a, it takes a lot. Uh, let's buy the knife. And this one is pretty good. Yeah, I'll get the Bone Dagger of Romulus. It's pretty strong. Weapons. Mm. Mm -hmm. I like the Sicilian Rapier. But the uh, this one is definitely pretty good. You know, I'll buy it. Even though I don't get any damage output from it. But it's still one of the best at the moment, so we'll buy it. Bam. Alright, and now where... E I think the, um, uh, the, the, the tailor slash... Uh, yeah, the tailor's over here. We'll go over here. Oops. Hit them. Right, go over here to buy uh, the other pouches. Uh, which one should we do for? First, okay. I say medium. I meant the large. We'll get the large medicine pouch first. Then we'll get the knife belt upgrade. Granted, we have enough money to buy them all. I'm just figuring out which one to do first. Uh, heavy heavy sheath. Medium quiver. Uh, we're gonna do the large. Uh, the medium bag for the parachutes. And now the large bag for parachutes. And now the large poison vial, bam. Now we got all the things that we can at the moment from this place. And don't need anything else, but we can buy parachutes, so we'll do that. Bam. Have all of that now, and now let's go over here. We'll buy these paintings. There we go. There we go. This one is a shit ton of money. For some reason. I guess that's one of them. A very important one. Uh, and this one we still need to one more of the Pomandary shit. Alright. Now let's go back to the blacksmith slash medical place and get all the... Uh, the equipment, or refill all of our equipment now that we've upgraded our uh, stuff to have all this extra equipment. Bam. Ammunition, throwing knives. Bam. Alright. Fresh 
And now this. Medicine, refill on medicine. Refill on poison, even though I don't use it. And we still need a lot of stuff for the uh, faster poison. But bam, alright. Before we do the assassination contracts, I'm gonna go inside our hideout to a check up on our assassinos. As I believe every single one of them has returned from uh, where they were. From the contract they were at, uh, signed to. I uh, forget where. It's on this side, the left side. Bam. And also, uh, another thing, uh, I think I mentioned it in an episode or two ago when I went in here to look for it. Now, uh, when uh, at the end of that one uh, uh, sequence four, that's when we uh, have access to it, but yeah. Alright, Assassinos, we have two that are level seven. Uh, they are Givir, I'm not even going to try to pronounce it to be honest. Auto upgrade now since they have their full armor. Just gonna do auto upgrades. But yeah, we have two level sevens, three level sixes, two level fives, and two level fours. Alright. And we have a few pla we still have a decent amount of places to go to. Um, I look up for the m tougher ones. There we go, Gone Silent. Yeah, we're gonna do that one. Gone Silent. Years ago, several of our brothers were sent to Moscow. One of them was Pietro Antonio Soleri. An architect invited by Ivan III to uh, renovate his fortress of uh, command, the Kremlin. We gained valuable information about Ivan's plans, but Pietro's apparent death has left us in the dark. Use whatever means necessary to find out what happened to Solari and whether or not we are compromised. Let's send in our best boys along with one other recruit. Or not recruit, uh, another, another one of our good uh, guys. Yeah, this... Uh, I don't know, let's see... We might have enough? I think we might just have enough. On the trail, Louis XII has left his kingdom in the hands of the Templars loyal to Bo the Borgia. They have captured one of our brothers and now subject him to torture in order to loosen his tongue. If they break him, the impact could be staggering. Confront Arch Archbishop Georges de Ambos, Louis' chief advisor. No doubt the Borgia have his ear. So we'll send our two strongest, and then we'll send our two secondary strongest, and bam. And now, let's see, we have a two level fours, so they won't be able to do uh, level threes by themselves, so we'll just spread rumors. We, uh, we will provide you with a list of Templar politicians. You will work within their city to spread lies and slander their names. Alright, bam. Alright, Moscow, we're going back to Moscow to defend a politician. Opposing the Templars is a dangerous move, but one that we must encourage. One politician is ignoring the risk. risks. Make sure he survives his bold actions. And we'll send another one of our assassinos to do such a thing. Bam. Alright, let's get to the assassination con uh, pigeon thing for the uh, contract. And then I'll check the time before we uh, do it. I know we still have plenty of time in the episode, but I want to make sure we have enough time to do what I kind of have planned for this episode, if that makes any sense. But yeah, I'll be right back. Alright, we have enough time to do what I have planned. So, let's get to it. Let's get this mission. The Three Amachi. To bolster his troops, Cesare has begun to recruit untrained soldiers. His veteran trainers are critical to his success. Find and kill them, Machiavelli. Kill the targets with the hidden blade. Got it. it. Looks like there's three of them throughout a portion of the city. Don't know how bit, how large of a portion of the city. Let's actually look. Okay, they're all in the same area. Two are close by, so I'm going to definitely go to the two that are closest to each other first. Because I can easily go between the two of them. You have lost whatever special quality it is. That you Yeah! 
That's one down. Time for another. Where is he? There we go. Hi, buddy. And they're gonna chase me. Which is reasonable. I just killed their fucking uh, veteran trainer. Those aren't exactly easy to come by all the time. Fuck! I got stuck on the uh, the fight. Shit. It's all right. That's all right. You. Fuck you. Fuck you. And fuck you. Alright. We dealt with them. I think the treasure is in here. Yep. And now we head towards the next assassination contract once I locate it. Uh, it's right there. Bam. All right, let's go. Looks like there was a chest while I was <laughs> climbing up these buildings. Bam, all right. We're about halfway there. Halfway there. Oh, Jesus. Get out, get out the end. You know what? Let's bribe a guy. How much it costs? 500? Eh, 500 ain't shit. Hey, stop spreading lies, motherfucker. Thank you. <laughs> uh. Alright. Time for another mission. Bam. Bearers of bad news, the Borgia have unleashed their interrogators. If they cannot find us, they will brutalize the people of Aroma until they get answers. Strike with precision or you may be overwhelmed. Machiavelli. Full synchronization, do not let your targets call for reinforcements. Got it. I think the best course of action was to use smoke bombs to disorient, disorient uh, the enemy, and from there I shank them all as fast as I can. I think that will be the best approach I have. It would be easier if I had my assassinos with me, but since they're all on mission, I won't be able to do such a thing. So. Gonna have to be a little patient. Looks like I have to go around. Something about the apocalypse. <laughs> <laughs> 
Bam, worked out just as I planned. Just as I planned. Let's fucking go. Alright, the next one is over here. Alright. Let's do it. Someone will suss on me for a second. Let's get rid of that poster. And make our way to the next one. And bam. Of course, the contract's been completed, so find a mole. One of our allies has been brought to by the board has been bought by the Borgia. This poses a risk to our secrecy. Find and kill him. And we'll send her back out again. We're... Oh, fuck. I accidentally pressed the, the back button to a second time. Uh. Mission. Red Letter Day. Our enemy is fling, feeling pressure as we close in. Important messages are now delivered by armored mercenaries. This tactic will not slow us. Ensure the messages uh, die with their couriers. Machiavelli. Kill both targets in under 60 seconds. Holy shiza. I might have to use uh, some... Oh god. That out. I might have to use the crossbow for that. I wonder if it, the 60 seconds counts once we kill one. Or once we, uh... Bam! Alright, let's get the fuck out. Fuck out of here! Alright, we're good. Alright. I think that's all the assassination contracts available at the moment. Uh, if we, uh, look at the DNA. Yeah, let's see. Oh, nope, there's another one. But where is it? Where is it? Oh, there it is. I didn't see it until now. Okay, well, time to go to do that one. Looks like another mission just got completed. Oop. Failed? A mission failed? Nani? Did my assassin die? No, it didn't. But she just failed it. She had 100% though. What? That didn't make sense. That definitely doesn't make sense. Intercept a message. The Templars will soon send instructions to their men. Find the courier, steal the message, and bring it to us. Alright, this time, don't fail, please. Fuck. I keep doing that backspace, uh, uh, the pressing the circle button one too many times. Alright, now for the final assassination contract for now. The Merchant of Rome. Merchants under Borgia protection often trade favors at the expense of their honest peers. Teach them that Borgia protection is a myth, Michele. Machiavelli. Full synchronization. Use the assassin of recruits to assist in the diversion. Well, shit. I don't have any of those. So either... <laughs> well, hopefully they complete their mission by the time I get there. Nope. Oh, fuck. I mean, I could probably, like, buy time, like... Because it's probably some distance away. Not too far away, but... Still some distance. Okay, that. Ah, <laughs> uh, fucking hell. Oh shit, it's right there. Okay, well. Uh, can we buy a building while we wait? Jesus Christ, the Panther not. 
costs a lot more than I remember. Uh fuck. We're gonna have to wait for our assassin recruits. Uh shit. Use the assassin recruits to assist in a, in a diversion. Yeah, so that means we kill them by killing- like, sending them to kill, like, the two guards in front of the person. Which isn't gonna be easy. I'm just gonna have to wait for them to come back. Really? Uh. Oh, we got our assassins back. Let's fucking go. I definitely have to do that one again. How did that fail? I caused I told them to kill those guards, which caused a distraction or a diversion. What? Yeah, I'm gonna definitely have to come back to do that real quick. Give me a second. Alright, let's try this again. It might not have worked. Okay, that time it worked. That is a little weird. I'm gonna not I'm not even gonna front. That's that's a little weird how that time it worked. But the previous time it didn't. Huh. I don't know why it didn't work the first time. But well, either way it's a hundred percent now. If any of y'all can figure out why it didn't work the first time, but it worked out this time, let me know in the comments. But that was that was definitely a bit weird. And it looks like all the assassination contracts that we can do at the moment have been completed, so that's very good, uh, good to hear. We're going to go to this pigeon coop next to this uh, Cortez on assignment. As uh, we're gonna probably going to do that is what we're probably going to do for the, the next thing. That, yeah. That's what we're gonna do next. <laughs> uh, fuck it now, but... Oh, there is this, which I think it's the other door. Oh, there is no door. Never mind, I'm dead. I'll just keep going. Never mind. I'm tripping. Okay, how do we get up there? Climb, obviously, but... For a second, I didn't know where from where. There we go. All right, interact. I was look at our assassins. We have several that are now at level seven, and we have two more that have turned level six, and two more are still um, on mission. Four more minutes, it looks like. All right, all right. Contracts. Let's see. Let's look for one that's pretty difficult. Not that type of difficult. I'm talking about the, like, the star versions. There we go. Pretenders. Templars actively struggle to gain power over the English throne. King Hen Henry VIII spoiled their first two attempts, imprisoning Lambert Simnel and hanging Perkin Warbeck. Both pretenders to the throne, but bo uh, both of them had a co-conspirator, Margaret of York. But Henry cannot touch her due to her family ties to the Holy Roman Emperor. Henry does not know who we are. Well, he knows what we can do. 
Meet with him. Assure him you will see to it that Margaret dies. Naturally. Let's send our top assassins. Uh, let's send... A uh, weaker one. Bam. Or less experienced one. Alright, a fighting chance. Travel back to Lisbon. We are supplying your ship with weapons, rations, and simple armor. Teach the oppressed how to use them. Give them the tacti tactics to strike back against Manuel's men from the shadows without raising an alarm. We do not have the resources to fight their war, but we can help them survive it. Boop, boop, and boop. Hmm... Yeah, fuck it. Make sure it's 100%. Bam. Alright then. Bam. Another one down. A another set of uh, contracts to be completed within the next 8, 4 to 12 minutes. Alright, we should have enough time to, to do the Cortesan mission, which was the next thing I wanted to do for this mission, and probably the last thing to do, depending on how long it takes. Entertained by Varese ambassadors last night. They must have poisoned me. How? We drank from the same cup. I don't remember what happened next. Come, we must find them. The morning after, the courtesan will identify the man who poisoned her, punish them, complete the mission in under 400 seconds. Alright, let me just equip my fist to beat their ass. Come on. Show me who to beat up. If I was on a mission, I would murder you all and loot your bodies. I find it funny that Ezio literally is uh, willing to put up with this. Horseman, I will hijack you if you keep hitting my uh, NPC right here. Will you be attending the festa at the Palazzo Arsini next week?
procession to Mark San Vincenzo di Bernazzano's crossing the road with the leg of San Duarte will be blessed by the bringing out of Giotto's ascension and San Torstola's left arm. Several Rioni will be visited. See the Chiesa d'Or for details. At the request of the Condottiero Simone of Chibianchi, his execution will be conducted via Spanish. Him! Get him! Bastardo! <laughs> Two of them were there last night. Buona fortuna. And stay out of the wine, Madonna. <laughs> uh, that, I love that. It's just a tiny little mission just to beat up some guys. That you don't even know if they're at fault for anything. Uh, that that's that's still hilarious to me. I think there might be some more Cortesan missions unlocked, but we have to go through here, which I think if we go in there, that starts the next first, the first main mission of the sequence, which is not what we're going to do. I think what I'm going to do is probably do the next Crustina mission. If we have enough time to do so, I'm going to check real quick and also withdraw some money from this bank. Yeah, let's do this first. Draw that money. Alright, now I'm gonna check if uh, we have the time to do the Christina mission. And it looks like, yeah, there's more uh, Cortesan assignments I can unlock with uh, Maria if we go in there, but I think it activates the first the, the first mission of the uh, this sequence, so I'm gonna avoid doing that just for now. Uh, I checked the time. And I don't really have much time left to do another ma uh, side mission slash uh, memory. So what I think I'm going to do is end the episode here. But first I'm going to uh, just check the DNA stuff. So obviously we're on sequence 5. The first one we'll soon uh, start getting to. We don't have any ability to unlock any of the other Templars layers or layers of Romulus. Uh, we have completed all the war machines. Oh, uh, we've completed the majority of the Borgia Towers, so there's only three remaining. There is, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, either five or six Christina missions, and one is available at the moment. We've done maj about two-thirds of the assassination uh, contracts, with the remaining ones being unlocked probably in a sequence or two. We've done a third of the Thief missions, or almost a third. I think the next section of them either unlocks... In this sequence or in a later sequence, uh, we can unlock more courtesan missions, which we'll do in the next episode most likely. Um, there's these missions which I can uh, that I attempted that one time but failed. But now that I have uh, a better sword, I'm pretty sure I can uh, do this one pretty easily and continue on with that. With the guild challenges, I have compl I'm rank five. Uh, rank I'm rank five so far. I'm unranked with the mercenaries. I'm rank 10 with the Courtesans and rank 10 with the Thieves Guild. And if we look, uh, we still have a decent amount to do. We have to do a lot more Leaps of Faith. Um, uh, perform a dive that from a height of 25 meters we still have to do. We have to glide a cute, lumative amount of 500 with the Parachute, which soon will ha be easy. Uh, air Assassinate from a beam, that will be easy. We just have, haven't had an opportunity to, to do so. Um, but the courtesans, we've done two things. We almost got enough. We almost got another thing with killing uh, during a smoke bo smoke bomb attack, and then we need two more from blending spots. Um, the other ones we haven't done yet, but we'll soon be able to do those. Uh, the mercenaries. Let's see. We we're able to do one of them, obviously, already early on. We are. Uh, what's it called? Doing a decent amount of them at this point. The double assassinations will soon be done. I probably will get those done within the next few episodes. Um, the kill streak easily could be done with the, that one side mission. Um, disarm enemies, that's somewhat easy to do. P uh, brutes, the papal guards, well, ho guards killed while on horseback. All those things I can do easily. It's just slowly doing them as time goes on. 
And if we look at our uh, sazons, we got the one done with, within a core memory. Um, we need to do 15 more times with a signal to kill 14 more arrow storms, uh, 25 during a fight, and five re uh, to raise to the rank of assassin, which several of them will soon be because I think rank assassin is uh, rank 10. Or uh, it's either rank 10 or um, it's rank 9 because I think rank 10 might be master assassin. Maybe, I'm not 100% sure. I forget the ranking system for the assassins in general. But um, anyway, in the next episode, what we're going to do is probably do firstly do the Christina mission. Then we'll most likely do this restored memory. Then we'll start the uh, co. I can't. Pr I still can't pronounce it. I'll figure out how to pronounce it probably by next episode. Hopefully, we'll start this uh, uh, series of missions. I don't know how many are unlocked at the moment, but we can do this one here, and then from there probably do the next one if it pops up, and basically continue that storyline until we can't, and then we'll go to the main mission. And either if we if we can get inside the building without starting the main mission, then I'll talk to uh, Maria about more court design assignments. And then I'll start the main mission from there, do the main mission, and then do more side activities. And maybe even start collecting a bunch of these um, treasure that's all around the place since there's a lot of them and it will be beneficial to do so. But yeah, that's my semi-plans or potential plans for the next episode. I'm going to end the episode, this episode here. So, yeah. Hopefully you all enjoyed today's episode. I certainly did. Until next time, this is Ghost signing out.